everybody. Let me see. Okay, it looks like it's going a little wonky. Sorry about that, you guys. Um, I'm going to give you a little tour of the garden before I water it because it's pretty hot out here in Georgia. So, here's a look at the... Um, right here I got some kind of peppers. Look like a green bell pepper there. Uh, some peppers here. Um, growing. We've got two different kinds of eggplants here. The Black Beauty and a Japanese eggplant in this pot over here. Um, some tomatoes. They look like they are doing fine. I'm not sure what kind it is. I uh, thought I stuck a thing in there, but here it is. It's in here. Uh, some super sweet 100 tomato. Um, there's the lavender for last year. And oh, I see the Cubanelle sweet pepper here. Over here is some tomatoes, a bunch of tomatoes I started in the house and they were suffering. So I stuck them in here to see how they were going to do and grow. Here I put some, I don't know, it looked like some old onions in there from last year. But I put some, Lily put zinnias in there, so I'm looking for them to come up. Over here, I planted a, a sugar baby watermelon, so hopefully it come up. This is a rose, but piece of a the rose bush plant, and it doesn't look like it's doing too well, so I might have to plant something else in there. Uh, let me open up the veggie pod here. I put a couple peppers in there and replanted some spinach in there. I pulled out the kale, but I didn't plant that. It planted itself. Uh, I got a couple red carrots in here. Um, as you can see, there's more coming carrots over here. Uh, uh, some lettuce. Uh, we It's too hot for lettuce, so we're going to have to get this while it's young before it goes bolting. And I, I actually planted some more Paris, Paris Cos lettuce over here. It's supposed to have been a bib lettuce here. I think I put a mix up in here somewhere or some romaine lettuce and I, I just planted them and I you could see I could you could see how they're coming uh, a couple more peppers over here so I'm look it's early in the growing season so I'm looking forward to the garden this year hopefully pray that we have Lots of success and lots of harvest. And over here, this is a citronellus plant that's been with me for about three years now. Uh, over there is some flowers and uh, tulips and stuff. I actually planted uh, a squash plant in there too, so let's see how it fares. Here, this is the green stalk. And... It's an awesome planter to grow in. Uh, I planted this year, so it's supposed to turn. I planted some strawberries in here. Uh, so I want to have plenty of strawberries. I actually planted some uh, beans in here, too, on this level. So I'm looking for it. I don't see anything yet. And some cucum lemon cucumber down there. So this is what the trellis here is for lemon cucumber i'm gonna come out here um these strawberries i got from uh home depot plants but um i'm gonna plant some from seed in here in the empty spots so looking forward to that i put some cilantro up here so there's a lot of empty spots here so uh, i'll put some more strawberries there i think they'll do good there and over here we have sage from last year and an orange bell. So hopefully the orange bell and that do good. Got some more peppers over here. These are like ones of ghost pepper, jalapenos, and a Cajun bell there. Uh, that's the fig tree. It's green, so I hope, hope it does well. And as you can see, the lemon tree has greenery on it. 
So hopefully we get some lemons this year. And there's a shishito pepper and some more kale in there. And if you can see, I got them covered up. But there's blueberries growing in here. And I covered them up so the birdies won't get them. Uh, this is a lily. It was orange lily that um, my son's friend gave me for Mother's Day. The leaves have since fell off, but they'll be back. They'll be back. And over here is a tomato plant. And I don't see the... I don't know what kind because I don't see the the label. I don't know where it went. It, but in here I planted some Crenshaw melon. So hopefully I'll get a little cantaloupe this year. Um, over here... I planted my okra, so hopefully they'll be coming up soon. And there's some the red lilies from last year, some rosemary. Uh, this is another plant that I had in sight. Hopefully it do well. It was a good-hearted tempted temptation tomato, so hopefully it does produce well. And this is another. Uh, tomato here uh, they got berry it's called the Parks something Parks Whopper tomato so hopefully stuff the garden's going to flourish especially if stuff grows fast especially when it's hot over here it looks like some strawberries I don't know that was a bean. It doesn't look like it's doing well. So I planted some more beans in here. So hopefully they'll come up. And more tomatoes. Uh, one, this one's a better boy. And I, I'm trying to see the label. Label is kind of deep. Uh, that says broccoli. It's not broccoli. It's tomato. But what kind? I'm not sure. But pretty much, you guys, this is Trinkle's Garden Tour. Um, I said it was the first one. It might be the second one, but it's the, it's the one with plants. <laughs> and so, we'll, we'll be back to, to see it when it flourish. Right now, I got to whip out the holes and water it I'm also seeing quite a few strange buzz it's a little breeze coming by but it's been hot so I don't want the plants to suffer at all but in the meantime you all have a wonderful day and I'll be seeing you soon till then Talk to you later. Have a blessed day.